When they announced Resident Evil 4 Remake, everyone started fantasizing about gunning down zombified bumpkins. Well, I started fantasizing about airborne particulates. Yes, everyone's favorite mystical element, fog. Resident Evil 4 notorious for its inclement weather and I couldn't wait to see how the PS5 using advanced fog tech would render this fluffy stuff in the remake. Well, here it is. I welcome you now to the top five foggy moments in Resident Evil 4 Remake. Number five, the forest fog. Right out of the gates and setting an appropriately scary mood is the forest fog. It's wispy, it's wafting through the tangled underbrush as I scratch my way through the darkness towards the initial encounters. It's the kind of fog you think of in every dark folk tale creeping through a haunted forest. It's a forest fog, a classical forest fog, and I'll always remember this unsettling stroll through the woods. Number 4. Attaché Case Fog After playing Resident Evil 4 Remake for a while, you'll have to manage your inventory, and that's where you'll find some easily underappreciated, overlooked fog. Our number 4 foggy moment. An infinitely generating curtain of mist cascades down the screen. And it's a nice fog, because it's a safe fog. You can gaze at it and know that a scary monster isn't going to jump out at you. This is a cozy fog. It's a peaceful fog for you to enjoy while you organize your goods. Number 3. The Town Hall Fog when I revisited the village town hall and swung open those doors, I immediately saw that Capcom was bringing it and they're coming hard with RE4 Remake. A thick, milk-like, low-lying fog undulates at your feet. It dazzles the eye. I feel lighter than air. I feel as if I'm pirouetting across the surface of a bubbling cauldron. Look at the beautiful way it dances to a supernatural rhythm only it can hear. Only the fog can hear the music, but we can observe the dance, and it's lovely. Number 2. The Graveyard Fog When I think of the graveyard greats in gaming, I think of Ghouls and Ghosts and Maximo, Mortal Kombat, and of course Resident Evil. In this case, we're treated to a spooky setting that we can get to revisit under changing weather conditions. My favorite being the foggy night with flashing lightning and blowing rain. A special shout out to the blowing rain in this game. When married with the whipping mist, it leaves you with an elemental experience that's hard to forget. Number 1. The Castle Fog Upon distant approach to the castle, I knew I was in for a treat with the ample clouds of fog and cinder floating in the air. The thick surrounding forest below swims with a misty gloom. But once inside, ominous haze makes way for a crusading fog. First found floating at the floor amongst the crooked pews, forming natural smoke rings and refracting the firelight amongst a billion floating particles. And this spectacle is only an appetizer to the main course. As I ascend the steps into a great hall, a glowing blanket of fog ripples across the floor. Lit by candlelight and flowing amongst gargantuan pillars, this fog makes clear that it's the showpiece we all came for. After dispatching the goon squad, Ashley and I are free to frolic in the effervescent layer of cumulus wonder. This is the fog I sought out, and it's here where I'll remain. Well, that's it. Did you enjoy my foggy recollections of Resident Evil 4 Remake? Do you think I missed a fabulous foggy moment? Did I give some fog the shaft? Please let me know either way. Thanks for watching and for all your support. And if you haven't already done so, please go to patreon.com slash easyallies and join us to keep the fog rolling. <laughs>